Hello, today I'm going to show you how to install uh, DNS and name servers for Windows Server Standard Edition R2 or oh, 2008. Oop. First of all, you need to uh, go into Server Management or Server Manager and add a role. The role needs to be your DNS. I'll just go through all this and just click Next. Wait for it to install. Close. I always install as well the IIS because I find that one of the best for installing many things. Well, for running websites mainly. Okay, we'll pick the record up when it's finished. Okay, it's finished installing. It's just installed IIS and the configuration settings I wanted. Okay, now we've done that, we need to go into roles, extend roles, go into DNS, and into there, into DNS after that. Then onto your server, it's my server name, and forward lookup domains. What you need to do is you need to add a new zone there, and to make it primary and just type in your website address, for instance mine's duplexserver.eu I just like to take the DNS off there and just click finish okay once in here you see a name server and you want to add and you want to type in for example ns as this is your name server duplexserver.eu Resolve sometimes it. Wait, nope, that's not the correct IP. We want it to get this machine's IP, so what is myip.org? Get your machine's IP. And there we go. Just click OK. So you've got a second DNS, well, I only need to set up one, but if you need to set up two, what you do is you just click add. You type in ns2.duplexserver.eu and then you'd add another IP address on top. There should be two different IP addresses. Okay, after that, just click apply and OK. Next, you want an A, and all you want to do is just type in your domain there. Add host, and then you want to add the prefix and just click add host again. Done. Okay, what we can do now is we can actually we can actually try it. Uh, let's see if this actually works. And it's hit an internal error because I probably haven't set up um, IIS that well. But as you can see, you've got your name server, your domain, and the uh, prefix, which is World Wide Web on the front of it. What you can do, um, which makes it resolve a lot faster, is use OpenDNS. As simple as just going on Google and just typing in OpenDNS. Well, it took me a while to learn how to do this. I hope it helped everyone else. Uh, thank you for watching.